So once you're done sailing and you're safely back in the slip, you want to make sure that your boat is put away properly. First thing you're going to do once all of your crew is safely on the docks is have them give you your, their life jackets, put them back down in the companionway, and you can put the companionway doors back on. Top one goes on last. After that, all of your lines, you can make sure that your boom bang is un uncleated. You'll wrap the left four lines around the port winch. Nice loose wraps. You don't want them too tight. Just to make it neat. And then on the starboard side, you do the same thing around the starboard winch. Again, you don't want your wraps too tight. Just nice and loose. Keep it neat and make sure that the lines don't get tangled. After that, we want to make sure our backstay is in tight. Right now, as you can see, it's not tight, but you want to make sure by just pulling both lines. And both lines are loose. After that, you want to make sure that your boat isn't hitting the side of the piling. In case it's storms or high winds, you don't want it hitting the sides and damaging the boat. So I'm just going to go ahead and pull the boat and see if it hits the piling. <laughs> As you can see, it, it's hitting the piling. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to secure, tighten up the starboard side on the bow and the stern. You don't want to make it too tight and have all the lines taut. You just want to make sure you're doing it enough so that the boat's not hitting. And if, after you after you tie them up again, you just want to make sure and uh, recheck. Now I'll go to the stern. make sure that none of your lines are in the water. So as you can see um, on the port side here, the bow cleat, this line is in the water, so you just want to go ahead and pull it out. And you can always wrap it up um, neatly, just kind of keep it out of the way. Sometimes you do a coil. And that's that for putting your boat away properly. <laughs> 